Hello everyone. Uh, thanks for watching my videos. Today I am going to describe uh, a new SW82HD washing machines controller repair tips and troubleshooting procedure uh, as well as uh, how to get this up and running uh, a washing machine if uh, the controller is faulty. Okay, let's get started. Uh, first look at the wire harness it has two connectors uh, blue connect blue colored connector and the white colored connector the blue colored connector is for the actuators such as main motor top motor and water valve and white colored connector is mainly for the sensors um, water level sensor, uh, door sensor, as well as safety sensor. Wire color codes are important uh, before the start of the troubleshooting. The first two wires are the main supply from the main electricity. First one is the bio, and blue colored one is the uh, neutral, and orange colored uh, line is for the top motor and red and yellow colored lines wires are for uh, the main motor to rotate in either directions and last uh, pink color wire is for the uh, water wire. let's see the same in the wiring diagram this is the actuator side this is the sensor side let's give the main supply to the controller to the brown and brown and blue wires we can connect to the main supply and see the quality controller beeping After some time, it gives the faulty alarm. We cannot do anything after we hear the faulty alarm. Before doing any further troubleshooting, uh, we need to understand the control circuit first. To start with, this is the main transformer which steps down the main supply to 12 volts and it is rectified using this four diode and that DC voltage is further stepped down to 5 volt using uh, 78 or 5 IC regular linear regulator IC and that 5 volt is passed to the microcontroller um, that is how the power design in this uh, circuit has been done after that the main components uh, are the uh, there are four triacs that uh, drive the all drives all the actuators the first one located here which is the uh, the pink wire is powered by this triac it is for the water valve and there are two tracks located uh, here these two tracks drive the main motor to the both directions and there is another track located in here uh, which uh, does the uh, top motor uh, rotation um, before doing any further troubleshooting you need to check these tracks are uh, working properly and uh, we need to remove those and check the continuity that the the terminal should not be should not be short circuited if they are short circuited uh, the uh, tracks are faulty if you after you do this do that replacement and those four actuators are 
cannot be directly driven like those four uh, triacs cannot be directly drive from the microcontroller therefore intermediate uh, uh, driver ic has been placed here this is um, ul um, uln uh, 2003 uh, um, that ic will drive the drive all the uh, triacs actually ULN203 is a um, Darlington array uh, IC that has seven Darlington's uh, Darlington is uh, two transistors coupled together to give more power and these transistor from the primary side input side can be driven directly by this microcontroller Um, unfortunately, the number of that microcontroller has been erased purposefully by this by the manufacturer because people make duplicates uh, and to keep their uh, market safe. Um, other IC you see on the rightmost side is the uh, TC four zero um, six nine. TC4069. This is uh, for the water barrel sensor. Uh, this is kind of this act like a oscillator. The oscillator's frequency would change if when the water barrel sensor's uh, um, conductor uh, inductance changes. The when the water level goes up, that uh, sensor sensor's inductance increases, and due to that, the frequency changes. With that, the, the processor can understand, um, microcontroller can understand what the water level is. This is the buzzer which do the different alarm signals. These are the set of LEDs, indicator LEDs, but I think uh, these are not uh, new. And uh, one thing I missed is the um, relay, which is uh, which is also activated when the washing machine started and when when the wash cycle starts the this relay powered up to give the power supply of uh, 230 volt to the uh, triax uh, terminal one uh, each track uh, all the tracks are connected to triax terminal one is connected to this relay it is kind of a power saving or safety feature that uh, the circuit board is not getting powered when when this relay is switched off. Uh, 